As summer comes to an end and temperatures begin to drop in North America, one of nature's greatest spectacles is beginning. Elk can be heard calling from miles away. Violent battles will take place. This is The Rut. Autumn has begun and the once quiet forests are no longer silent. Male, or as otherwise known, bull elk make a loud, high-pitched call known as a bugle. Bugling has several purposes, including announcing a bull's willingness to fight and showing his size. This call can be heard from miles away, echoing off of the mountains. The elk rut has arrived, starting the annual mating ritual. The female elk are called cows. The young ones are called calves. Bull elk will gather cows and calves into a group known as a harem. They will do their best to defend their harems from other bulls. The dominant bull will often move the herds around in an attempt to keep the cows away from other bulls. Bull elk shed their antlers and grow them every year. Elk antlers can grow up to one inch per day. By September, they are fully grown and ready for battle. He will remove the last of any velvet covering by rubbing his antlers on trees and bushes. Just below the eye is an opening known as a preorbital gland. This gland opens up during the rut to secrete pheromones which will also be left on shrubbery during this process. Bulls will often wallow in mud and urine covering themselves with a the perfume to attract the cows. They will also do this in order to cool themselves. For the bulls, there will come a time when sheer size and intimidation is not enough, and he will have to fight to keep his place as top dog. Two evenly matched bulls will usually spend more time squaring each other up than they will fighting. But when they clash, the rattling of the antlers can be heard from far away. Many times, this sound will attract other bulls. The younger or smaller ones will try to nab a few cows while the titans battle.
Once a winner is determined, the loser will usually retreat from the area. The rut can be particularly rough on both the winners and losers of the fights. The winner will tirelessly defend his harem from bull after bull, while the loser may have antlers broken, be injured, or even die. Driven by testosterone and a desire to breed, they fight on. As a cow comes into estrus, the bull will focus all of his attention on her. He must be ready as she is only receptive to mating for less than 24 hours. Once she is ready, breeding is fast and over quickly. With his genes now passed on and the rut coming to an end, this bull will leave the harem and return to his solitary life where he has earned a long rest. Until next year.